Okay, tonight is the Mega Moon. Hopefully, someone will win that jackpot. And hopefully, someone using the system will hit the jackpot <coughs> for tonight's draw. And remember, nobody hit the Powerball also, so I'm going to do a video on the Powerball. But before we get started, <coughs> I'm going to update you on the double down system for pick three. Now, I initially predicted the double down system for 12.06 to 12.02 for Pennsylvania's. And let's see what the result is. It so far hit one straight. And these are the lists. Now, if you go to set one, set two, the multiplier are three and two. Set three, four, multiplier and three and one. Set five, set six, multiplier are three and three. And the last set, been hitting twice. One hit. Uh, one multiplier, I mean. Now, let's go back to that. And I think 330 came up. For Pennsylvania State, December 10th. So it's a week of prediction. It came out two, two times on that set. Oh. Uh, 330, you see? Straight hit predicted for Pennsylvania State to play the set one time. So if anybody hit on this set, let me know. You can email me or comment on the, the, the video page. Now, now let's check. So that means we have four three and six six zero. So this set hit twice. Six six zero and three three zero. Remember the midday set is different from night draw. That means the midday set midday numbers and night draw numbers are separate. So that means that six six zero hit that hit evening. That means this set is real out for evening draw. So now, once you real out for evening draw, this set can still play for be played for midday. So that's why three three zero came. So this set was a hot set this week. Let's see if this hit, hit, hits again tomorrow or Thursday. Now I probably rule out this set for midday and evening since it came, since this set came out midday and it came out evening. Probably want to rule out this for midday and evening. So you want to focus on the other six sets. And if you want double down system for any other state or country, email me. I'll be glad to hit send you the list. And remember, thanks for the email. For Georgia pick three, the double down hit nine times. So somebody said it hit 12 times. I'm gonna correct the other person, the Georgia number that came this evening hit nine times using a double down method. So so that nine times. Or that uh, dollar play would be 4,500 win for 50 cents play. It will be 2,250 win for the 9 times multiplier. The hit for Georgia's evening number. Now, Georgia might hit again for night. Who knows? Now, let's get back to the Powerball system. Before we start, the uh, Powerball <coughs> is now 140 min. You can subscribe, donate, share, and like my video. And... Use the code caption and button. Remember, nothing is guaranteed. Email me at hyper underscore linkster at yahoo.com for any game prediction or request. I'll be glad to help you out on this uh, on this game also, Mega Man also, and any other game. And when I'm on my system, it goes to part 16, which is invisible numbers. And 17 is kind of working on that number. Now, for Powerball for 12, 7 to 12, 11, We'll be using this grid. Now, 12, 11 to 12, 14, we'll be using this grid. Now, before we get started on that structure, let's get to power winning number that nobody won, the multiplier or first prize. Now, I'm going to copy the number down to see where the hitting corner are. That's R again. I'm sorry about that. <clears throat> I'll be using new IDC system 
for tomorrow's Powerball. Now, I'm going to do... The grid... Now, let's see where the hidden cards are. 18. Let's look at 18. 18 is not in the IDC system. 42. 42 is in quadrant 1 or quadrant 4. Let's put that in quadrant 1. 42. 53. 53 is also in quadrant Almost in quadrant one, but one and three. So, left side quadrant has been hitting numbers. Now, 42 is not in the IDC system. 62, 62 is in another quadrant. It's not in the left side, in the right side. Be in between quadrant two and four. Now, 66, 66 is not in the IDC system. So, we only have four numbers in the IDC system so far. Three numbers and then 25 is the fourth number 25 is in the left quadrant also right quadrant I mean quadrant four <coughs> so this is the winning combination and <coughs> the obvious number as you can see was 25 52 one time, two time, three time, four times, five times, six times. So, I think I mentioned that number being obvious. Now, for tomorrow's draw, I'll be using this new ID secret system, 2078, 207083541086055255. 103544869. And the most common number, as you can see, probably 55. Might be obvious one time, two time, three time, four time. 5005. One time, two time, three time, four time, five time, six time. Six time in the IT secret system. So 5005, 55. Now, also, the other well known number might be not. 35 and 5303 and 30. Let's try 03 and 30. One time, two time, three time. 53, 35, one time, two times, three times. So these are some of the numbers that have a high frequency in the IDC ecosystem. And I'm not going to do the corner on it. I'm not gonna do the corners. I'm just gonna uh, show you where the hidden, hidden numbers are. So, so you have a chance not to pick that grid. So, eighteen again, quadrant two, eighteen, forty-two, quadrant. 4, 42 on the bottom, or over here, you see my star, 42, 53, 53, again, and another quadrant, quadrant 3, or quadrant uh, 1, 53, 62, 62 is not in the ID secret system, 66 not in the ID secret system, and 25, quadrant, quadrant 4, or quadrant 1. So this ID secret system is going to be very, very tricky, because why is it very, being very, very tricky? Because nine is in the corner and six in the corner. So the combination that only associate with nine are 59 and 69 only. And the combination that associate with the digit six, 06, 16, 36, 56. Now, these are the four sixes in the one spot. And for the 60s, you, you'll have 60, 61, 63, 65. So you're missing a lot of 60s. 
Oh, and six is over here. 68 and 69. So you're not much missing that much sixes. But as I said, the nine is being corner. So that's going to be a, tr a test if any digit nine comes in. And let's talk about the opposite attraction number. <coughs> Now, if you don't think 18, 42, 53, 62, and 66 will opposite attract any number for tomorrow's draw, then you don't play those opposite attraction number. Now, let's go for the opposite attraction number. Let's start with 66. 66 opposite attraction number is 66. 62 opposite attraction number is 26. 53 opposite attraction number is 35. 42 opposite attraction number is 24. And finally, 18. Opposite attraction number is 36. So if you don't think any of these opposite attraction numbers come, then you do not play. So for those of you who got my opposite attraction grid, you should know what the opposite attraction number is for those numbers from 1 to 70. What does each num number opposite attracts? Meaning, are they getting drawn? Now, I'm going through this video. Let's go, let's highlight the last draw. Now, last draw, talk about the opposite attraction number. Now, 08 opposite attraction, 35. So any 35 can draw? No. Now, 27, 27 is 27. 27 opposite attracts 27. So any 27 getting drawn? No. 44 opposite attract 44. So 44 then get drawn. 51 opposite tracks 15, no 15, and 61 opposite tracks, uh, 61 opposite track 16. So 16 didn't get drawn either. So opposite traction does help out also. Now let's talk about this. 15 opposite opposite track 51. Therefore the 51 came. So for the for the draw of 1130 opposite track number didn't help out. Now for 30 for the uh, for the other draw 27. The opposite attraction number didn't help out either. 53 opposite attracts 35. And for the, the previous draw, for the 11 23rd, 35 opposite attracts 53. So as you can see, the opposite attraction number didn't really help out on the prior to the last draw, the three draws. So you gotta watch out if there are more opposite attraction number that get drawn, the chance of, uh, of the future draw that will have opposite attraction number will not happen. So I'm saying tonight's draw, tomorrow's Powerball drawing will not have opposite attraction number. Now, if you like the video, you can subscribe, donate, share, and like my video. And email me and be emailing me at hyper underscore links at yahoo.com.